Hey guys, welcome to King Skeleton Channel. This is your boy Bo. How is everybody doing lately? Yes, it's been a long time since uh, made you know, excuse me, uh, videos and everything else. Um, but there's been some little bit of here and there incidents and everything else I had to personally take care of. Um, you know, one of the uh, issues and everything that I busted my ankle, um, which is right here. There's the picture. <laughs> Looks nasty, doesn't it? Um, the other thing it was is we have a problem with this. Remember this computer? Remember this? I don't have that no more. Uh, that's gone. Uh, and there's reasons for it. Uh, before I actually show you the detour of what I have now, which I hope you guys like. Um, I think it's more badass than the other one, I personally think. But, uh... The short story goes is make sure you guys don't click out of this uh, video just yet because there is something you guys need to know. So just hang on a second. Let me explain. Okay. Um, almost about a month ago, uh, something went wrong with uh, the PC that I've already shown you guys. Um, the lights inside the chassis and everything wouldn't work. Um, almost about the third to a half of the motherboard uh, of inside the computer was not working properly. It was working, but not the way it's supposed to and everything. And I did not know about that. All I wanted was the lights being fixed. And since I had a warranty on it, I shipped it back to HP for them just to fix the lights. Well, I got a phone call stating that the, there's more damage than what I was assuming that was into the computer. I did not know that. And the manager of HP, by the name of Victor, he said that when the his uh, mechanics or the people that fix his PCs uh, noticed that um, it was not damaged by me. It was damaged on the way here when I first got that uh, computer that I've already shown you guys. So it was their fault on their behalf. So they sent me a new one. A different one um, and I'm gonna show you a little clip and everything and you know on a little screen on you know whatever side I pick and show what you guys think of it and tell you the specs on what's in it um, but other than that um, let's uh, yeah anyway um, you guys hang on tight, wait for a few seconds because you're about to see something new that I thought I personally would never even have in my possession. So stay tuned. All right, guys, welcome back. We are going to now show you what they brought back to me for their stupidity and everything else. You guys remember the computer that I showed you the last time, uh, the last one I had and everything. Everybody was all like amazed by it and asking questions about it and everything. Well, now I'm going to show you the new one that they brought back to me and everything else right here. This one um, has a whole bunch of stuff that actually has more than the other one. Uh, from my perspective and do my apologies that I could not remember everything about this because I just got it yesterday so <clears throat> bear with me I am looking at my phone to tell you the specs of it and everything else so hopefully you guys can bear with me here okay so the CPU is a Intel Core i7 9th generation 9700k the other computer was a 3700x this one is 9700K uh, with 3.6 gigahertz, okay? Um, the other computer, I don't remember if it had this or not, but this one has it. Max turbo speed is 4.9 uh, gigahertz. And the number of cores, which is 8 core, um, the other one had an 8 core. Uh, this one has 8 core too. Um... And then it has a processor socket. It has a LGA1151 socket, whatever that means. Um, a install size uh, for the uh, memory is uh, 12 megabyte. And for the per processor, 12 megabyte. Um, 
per processor uh, size 12, install size 12. Uh, the RAM is a DDR4 SD RAM. Uh, the memory speed, which is I think that's the same speed as the other one, um, is uh, uh, 2,666 megahertz. Uh, the memory specification is a uh, PC4 21300. Um, the configuration features 2x8 gigabyte. Um, do, 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 do. Okay. Uh, max support size can be 64 gigabytes. Um, then it has do, do, the capacity is 1 times 256. I'm guessing 1 256 gigabyte. Do, 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 do. Uh, let's see if we can do anything else more important here. Um, it for the spindle uh, speed, it's 7200 uh, RPM, uh, which is I think the other one had the same thing. I think um, came with a keyboard and mouse, you know, your regular stuff. Um, does have Bluetooth uh, 4.2. Um, yep, it's a Core i7. Uh, Intel 3.6 gigahertz for clock speed. Oh one thing you can overclock this um, I did not know that I can overclock this the other one I don't know if I said in the video you could but you couldn't uh, the other computer that I showed you guys that I had the other tower You could not overclock but this one you can uh, the one that I'm telling you guys about so you can overclock this and I've already tried overclocking it and played like 15 minutes of gaming. It was a beast. I mean, I can, it feels a lot faster than the other one. And a lot more, it can able to handle more. I mean, I was able to run, with the other computer, I was able to run, um, see, for Call of Duty, I was able to push about 144 uh, gigahertz um per second or whatever you call it uh with this one i was able to shoot up all the way to 180 and she did not lag or anything um and i have one uh 144 gigahertz monitor that i'm staring at so it, it's it's a monster and it, it's really a beast i enjoy it and everything um but uh graphics it does, okay, it has the GeForce RTX 2070 Super. So it is an upgrade of what I had from the other one. Um, the, uh, when they sent this computer, um, they also sent me from, for like I said, for their stupidity, they sent me an extra hard drive, which is most towers now have the two slots, right? You have one that's already in there, and then you have one that if you want to put one in there, you can. Well, they sent me... A hard drive which is I did not they didn't tell me they were gonna do that it was a surprise so I stick that in there so now I have more room to work with uh, which is thank you to them and everything it does have HDMI um, uh, video memory 8 gigabytes GDDR6 SD RAM which is a lot more than the other one I think the other one was a four I think or a three um, It does have a uh, DTS Headphone X Studio Sound, one year warranty, and it has uh, USB ports and what have you and everything else. So uh, it has Windows 10, but anyway, I think you guys get the drift. Uh, but anyways, um, if there's any questions, leave comments below, I'll answer them. Uh, but any, other than that, um, I think it looks uh, badass. And like I said, my red and black theme and everything goes along with this. And it's, it's awesome. Um, the graphics card looks freaking huge. But other than that, um, but anyways, it was, it was a big mess. Um, they destroyed the other computer and I didn't know. Apparently, it was still working to where you couldn't really tell. And because I was able to play games, I was able to hype up the graphics and everything else. I was the only thing I wasn't able to do was uh, overclock. Um, this one you can, and uh, you know, 
the uh, HP said that, okay, well, if you send it to us and everything, we'll have it fixed and uh, have it back to you in three to five days. And I'm like, okay, three to five days, I can wait. You know, not that big of a deal. So I sent it to him and everything, and I waited for weeks and weeks and weeks. Um, I think it, it almost took him pretty much a full month just to get to get me a computer, either getting that one back or getting some kind of PC. Um, what they did was, for their stupidity, Victor, which I mentioned, um, is felt so bad to word that he actually upped the price. He actually asked me how much I spent on the other PC. I said about fourteen to fifteen hundred. And this PC I looked it up exactly what it has in this thing and it was a seventeen hundred dollar computer. So he put a few extra hundred bucks in there to make sure I had a nice cooling system and everything else and you know that that was really cool of him and everything but it was a pain in the ass um it took my fiance uh to yell at victor on the phone to yell at hp and everything they i'm sorry excuse my french but hp the service and everything is shit okay i'm not saying they're a horrible company because they do make awesome pcs but the way they handle on situations they suck at all right i went from talking to the head manager to corporate to i mean i was bouncing around for weeks I'm like, all I want is a damn computer. That's all I ask. And uh, Victor was about to send me the wrong computer after he just messed up the first one. And he was going to send me a small little of those laptop notebooks. And I'm like, what am I supposed to do with that? I'm a gamer, a YouTuber, and everything else. What the hell am I going to do with a notebook? He goes, oh, it was just a, a mistyping in a, a situation. Right. Okay, well... When in my computer gets here, you better pr hope and pray it's the right one that you promised me. And sure enough, yesterday it came, and here we are. So now I'm able to, you know, make videos and everything else for you guys and whatnot. Other than that, that will be it. Sorry this video was kind of, uh, you know, boring and everything else, but I wanted to explain all this on why I disappeared for several weeks. Um, I explained everything and whatnot. If you have any questions or anything like that make sure you leave comments below i'll answer anything or try to answer anything that uh you guys have for me Alrighty, so thank you for watching please please subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell and i will see you next time have a good one